I'm Kaylee. I'm Steve. And we are exploring outside the 303. So we wanted to take a minute and just share a little bit about how we even came to be full-timers. And um, it actually started two years before we had launched. Came home one day and said, all right, we got to do something different. <laughs> <laughs> and I immediately shut that down. Um, as Steve knows, I'm a very slow processor. <laughs> and so he was a wise man and gave me some time to think it through. Um, and it was about a year after he had initially uh, brought up the subject. Now, mind you, we had been starting to watch a lot of the other YouTube, like, popular YouTube channels about traveling and um, and this RV lifestyle and so it kind of had piqued my interest and so it was about a year later and I finally said okay let's do it <laughs> oh she didn't just say let's do it she's like let's do it now yeah and that wasn't gonna work <laughs> no I had to be the sensible one this time <laughs> I grew up camping um, and but we had um, we had a pop-up at the door. We started with a pop-up and then we went to a hybrid and so we had our hybrid little J is what we called him um, And so we knew we couldn't go full-time in him. He was 23 feet 23 foot uh, Very a lot of storage, but it would have probably got a little claustrophobic since the beds were kind of on each end and not really much privacy yeah. we, we had been going out probably 10 weekends mm -hmm. every year mm -hmm. 10 to probably 10 to 12 every every year so we had a good idea of what we had to do even in the cold so but we started our journey with looking for probably the perfect camper which took six months and <laughs> I can't tell you how many YouTube videos we watched how many web searches we did we went and looked at hundreds um, and we had I I had some requirements. <laughs> she had a lot of requirements. I had a lot of requirements. Um, so I wanted the kids to have a separate door that actually closed, not a curtain. Um, I wanted... What else did Our I Our separate room. Oh, and I wanted us to have a separate room. Again, I wanted that privacy because I know how important it is. I wanted a large bathroom. Oh, yeah. Um, anyway, it took us six months to find it. We did end up finding it. Luckily, you had spotted it. So we had done the normal camping world and all the ones local endeavor to us um and so we ended up with a catalina a coachman catalina 323 bhs something. oh there's a bunch of numbers there. <laughs> but we loved it so it's a 36 foot trailer it's got uh, the bunkhouse in the back we have two slides they have a door that actually closes we have two stairs to get outside um, one's from the bathroom our door closes and the bonus which we didn't even like at the first part was we have a fireplace, um, which we thought was so stupid. <laughs> Didn't really understand until someone goes, well, you know, you don't have to run it off propane. And I said, oh, okay, that's good. <laughs> Got it. Yeah, it's actually pretty smart. So, bonus. Um, and then we also have a really large outdoor kitchen, which we have... We didn't have a checklist for that. No, actually, I didn't even want one. I thought it was wasted space. Um, but we love it, and we get compliments all the time when we yep. have it open. Um, and so we'll show you um, all these things as well. We had bought a truck because Steve's existing truck, which was an F-150, wouldn't be able to haul that large of a trailer. Um, so we had bought the truck actually before we bought the trailer because yep. we knew generally the weight range that we were going to be in. Um, and so We you, went way over that. We did. <laughs> but we bought a 2015 Ram... 2500. 2500. Um, about a week before we actually were closing on the house, the transmission went out. Yeah. <laughs> Great timing. So, <laughs> we waited and waited for that one. And so both of our minds kind of wandered a little bit and we said, well, let's just get a brand new one. Full warranty, everything. We might as well start out right on this journey. New trailer, new truck, and let's go. <laughs> yeah. So we bought a 2019 Ram 2500. Bighorn. Bighorn. Um, which is awesome. We call her Tina. Um, and our trailer's called Lena. So we have Tina and Lena, and uh, they're the power team. And so that that's kind of started it right there. And then we sold the house actually in... June. June. And kind of started our adventures then, not really knowing where we were going to go. So from beginning to end, like when we fought... Well, when I finally agreed to <laughs> do this full-time living... Uh, it was, it was like 16 eight, to 18 months. Yeah. Um... 
and the big reason I think we decided to finally do this is we were in the rut. Um, we were doing the same thing every weekend, taking care of the house. Kids were just kind of milling around. Um, and now we're out. Um, when we're at our home base in Monument, Colorado, kids are playing with all the other kids. They don't even stop to think about it. It's great. Um, and they've met so many other kids just along the way so far. It's always go, go, go. We never really had time to like be with each other. So when Focus. you are home with each other, it's like, do the dishes, make the dinner, quit running around. Like it was just very like, it was hard. And I just, I feel since we've stepped into this lifestyle, we're closer. Um, we talk more, we have deeper conversations. We still let, you know, the kids get to go play and such, and we're still able to get our priorities done of working and homeschooling, yep. and we still clean up the trailer and things like that. But I just, I feel we have a, a deeper compassion for each other. Um, and overall, I feel, I feel closer. Yeah. And I, the kids have a smaller area. Mm -hmm. They, and we'll kind of do a tour later on of, what everything is laid out to be yeah so yeah we're um committed for a year and um we officially i guess officially launched in september um even though our house sold quicker than we had planned um but yeah so we're committed for a year um and we'll see where it takes us and we're glad you guys are joining us and following along with us i'm excited for our foursome uh, to go and explore um and to share it with you all that's it until next time.